What is up crew? It's your boy the RPG Prodigy here in my new room. Yeah, we finally got a room. Look at that. Anyway, during the last episode, we were told by Tesla that this would be our new home. Should everything die down. And we're having that one emotional moment when she had an argument with Amber. And you know, Amber went off to her room and we can't went to comfort um to comfort her. Let her know that hey man, you got a mom. I, I know it's like to have a mom that loves you. But in the middle of all that, Team Zen attacked and you know, kidnapped everyone. Um we were given a condition by Malice. In order to save Amber, we gotta bring her Melia. But I find that to be very contradictory. Like, um for those who don't know what I said last episode, last episode at the end, I said that if she wanted, she could have just captured Melia. So I just feel that's just why didn't you just take her? You got her knocked out on the ground right there. I don't know. Anyway, during this episode, we are going to rescue Amber. That is a promise. Uh, where is everybody? They said they were all knocked out. Like, seriously, where the hell is everyone? Okay, this is weird. If I remember correctly, everyone was just laid out on the ground. I expected to go down over there and find everyone still knocked the hell out. Huh. Then I guess we just go and rescue Amber. What about Melia? Screw Melia. I got this. I'm the prodigy. I can do this by myself. Trans to come to, many trainers come to this healing uh, spring to heal their Pokemon from any harm they've received on the road. There aren't many places on places to heal on this island, so you can blame them. Huh. I thought I would at least find some sort of... Eh, why is a blue shard here? I'd expect a red shard. I know I seem gripey, but hey. Okay, fresh water. Oh, that's, that, that is interesting. Have you heard of the Sylvie Islands? I heard they are have a hot spring just like this one. Ours, of course, is more exquisite and luxurious. Show off. I need to brag. It's like you're on top of a high horse. And you decide to put a horse on top of a horse so you can sit on top of that horse. Oh man. I forget where they said that we were supposed to go last episode. Where were we supposed to go to save him? But we need to find Amber in the group anyway, so... Oh, you, you actually teach moves. Which moves do you teach? Nah. Okay. I'm gonna check inside the house. I am still, like, running around wondering where the hell everyone is. Okay, there they are. Jesus. Mugen, are you doing okay? Hey, I was knocked out by a hypno. Don't ask me if I'm doing okay. We found you unconscious in front of the villa after we woke up. Tesla found a ransom note on you when she brought you inside. That malice. She played a dirty trick. We let our guard now. Hell yeah we did. My stomach feels like it's gonna explode. <sighs> well, Tesla was furious when she read the note. She burst off for, Mount, um, for Valor Mountain immediately. Now we have to worry about two people under hostage. It's all because of me. Keep your chin up, Melia. It isn't your fault. If you say so, I'm just at a loss of what to do now. Amber was the last gym leader on the island. We don't have enough time to go elsewhere to find another gym leader. Yeah, it sucks, but maybe we just gotta rethink our strategy. Maybe there's something else we can... Sorry, but an envelope just materialized out of thin air. Uh, it sure did. That, that's so freaky. Wait, something like this happened in Aquamarine Cave. You remember? Right, Mugen? That flower, flyer, sorry, the flyer that appeared over the statue. Amber said that Angie was behind the phenomenon. Maybe that witch is behind this as well. Should we open it? It might be a import. 
Oh, are we watching a movie? Is that Angie? Good evening to the recipients of this letter. My humble name is Angie, gym leader of the Sovereign and Sovereign of the prestigious Crystalline Town. Is this Angie? This envelope is an invitation to three specific people. Those being Melia, Mugen, and Venom. The three of you are allowed to visit my church located on the, Isle, on the Isles of Angels. I believe there's something you all may be interested in. A badge, perhaps? Of course, I realize that you all may be wary, so I'll give you even more of an incentive. I have two certain rangers held captive inside my church. I believe their names are Alex and Sam. They were foolish enough to believe they could face me. Such a foolish act. Failure to appear will mean their end. However, I must make myself clear. This invitation is for you three, and you three alone. And you are to make your way to my church immediately. Disregarding these conditions will result in dire consequences. I shall be on my way now, and thank you for listening. Aw oh, man, I saw that movie already. Lame. Jesus, what is wrong with you, Saki? I know what you're thinking, but this is a trap. I'm against any of you going to Crystalline Town. I'm aware of the possibility of this being a trap, but you heard what Angie said. She has Alex and Sam held hostage. Carly has, was, has sent dozens of rangers to deal with her, and they're all missing. For all we know, Angie has them hostage too. She's been too powerful for too long. Let's kick her ass! I don't approve, but you can make your own decisions. Just be careful and don't let your guard down. So um, how are we going to get there? Oh, I actually don't know. Take my boat! Huh? What's up with Mugen? So, what's up, Mugen? Tesla gave you the keys to their yacht? That's perfect. We can use that to get to Crystalline Town. Then it's settled, then. Yeah? Let's get going. R right. We can't waste any time. Sure. Let's go take my boat. <laughs> it's not the keys to their yacht, it's the keys to my yacht. She gave me the boat. It's my boat. Now here's the question, any of you know how to drive this thing? Ready to go to Crystalline Town? We might not be able to come back for a while. Make sure you're ready and prepared. Uh, do I got my, do I got my shit on me? Uh, I got potions, reverse candies. I need more repels and more potions. Give me a quick second. I know what y'all thinking. Oh, but you got max repel. I ain't using those. Call me stingy. Do I got no pokeballs? Fuck no. Look at that money, crew. Enjoy it. We'll be gone in a second. Nope. Gotta remember the meta. One of these. He's still up. Oh. Are right, we good to go? I'm gonna miss this place. Let's go. Seeing a snowfall on a tropical island is really surreal. It's gotten cold enough that the ocean is freezing over. I I'm so cold. Let's get this. Sorry, let's do this quickly. So we, we can go back to the resort. We need to find the Isles of Angels. Where is that? It should be close by. Let's look for it. Man, everything be frozen. Everything be frozen, frozen. Everything be frozen, frozen, frozen. Holy shit. You used to be a resident of Crystalline. Do you know where Angie's Isle, Angel, Isles of Angels is? But why? Why would you want to go there? The Isles of Angel is where Angie is. No, you must turn back immediately. We came here to deal with Angie, and for that, uh, and sorry, Angie, that, and for the TM called Mag Magma Drift. So could you point us in the right direction? That would be awesome. Y you're looking for the TM Magma Drift? If that's the case, then I can help you. My name is Farah. My grandparents own the TM shop in town. Please follow me. Nice. Let's go follow her then. Wait, we can't just follow some random person. For all we know, she might be part of Angie's trap. Remember, she said that we had to go straight to the church or else. Who cares what she says? We're going to get the TEM and kick her ass. Anyway, fine, let's go. Jesus. 
Everything is locked. Oh, they they locked locked. Holy shit, this place frozen frozen. About the Pokemon Center. Oh, y'all in here. There used to be a bell here in Crystalline Town. We would ring it whenever something someone we knew had passed. I wish someone would find that bell and ring it for us now. Angie has set a bunch of cur um, curfews for us. We're not allowed outside our houses after 7 p.m. Because that's when evil beings... What? 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 That's when evil beings to lurk the grounds? Okay. Begi sorry, begins to lurk the grounds, my bad. English be hard. This is just insane. We are blessed to have machines like these to aid us in dire times. Oh. Thank you for waiting. We restored your Pokemon to full health. Hope to see you again. You're not Nurse Joy. You're not the, the seller person. Oh god. Oh my gosh, a customer. We haven't had a customer ever since like um, the moment we arrived. <laughs> my mom always com is uh, my mom's always complaining. Patty, when you finally gonna make money and support our family? I'm just and I'm just like when you finally find a stable husband who doesn't leave you in a year. Anyways, enough of that. Welcome to Angie's Bazaar. Bazaar and all the stuff. Okay. I don't feel like conversing with this woman too long because I have a feeling I'm going to lose brain cells. Alright, let's get going. Okay. Please, come this way. Oh, it's a help center. My boys and girls in the help center. Aww. Grandma, Grandpa, we have guests. Farah, what are you doing bringing strangers here? Do you know how risky it is to bring people to you know our home? And she's always watching, and we can be punished if we if we're found out. I know that, but these people came here looking for a specific TM, the one you guys, um, you guys have all those. Sorry, it's the one you guys have all those old copies of Magma Drift one. Sorry, old copies of the Magma Drift one. Magma Drift. Why would these people want that TM? It doesn't matter. Let's give them what they want so they can leave. They seem. They seemed really scared. Is that okay? It's not okay. But there's something I must ask of you three. You changed for the TM. I want you three to um, drive Angie out of here once and for all. We told you that we're gonna do that anyway. I know. But I don't think you all understand what truly is at stake here. Or rather, what you're really up against. Countless rangers have visited this town with the goal of arresting Angie. Not one of them have returned to the town. We've become dis um, desensitized to it. But when I look at you three, I see a certain strength. Oh, sorry. Skip crap. Skip, skip pass, crew. My bad. Therefore, I believe you have a small chip. No. It's too late. She found us. Sh she found us? You mean Angie? You three need to leave. You need to leave right now. What about Magnetrift? Forget it. There's no time. What was her deal bringing us here and then kicking us out? And just when we were about to get the TM2. She said she found us. I think she meant Angie. Screw what she says. We came here for the TM, and damn it, we're gonna have it. Venom, wait! Woo! What the hell? I almost died! It must have been what Farah was, was scared of. Angie froze over the shop because we went there instead of the church. So she tried to save us. Whoops. That's it. I've decided. We can't let this go on any longer. Angie's terrorized this place enough. We're driving her out of here. Damn straight we are. Mugen, Melia, let's go. Let's get look for the Isles of Angels. It must be nearby. Hello, and welcome. My name is Professor Jenner. I've always wondered something when it comes to Pokemon. Can Pokemon understand the concept of morality? They say that there's no such thing as a bad Pokemon, but can that really be true? With more than oh, no, sorry, with more than 800 species, there must be a deviant living, um, deviant living within, one that lives off the chaos and suffering of the others. But that's taboo, isn't it? To think a Pokemon would be su um, such a way of na a way by nature. Humans too can be overwhelmed by evil. Nurses, teachers, gym leaders, political figures, business owners, and even normal everyday people. None of us are safe. None of us are safe. 
And you threw the fucking snowball at these people. What? I can't visit my bros in the help center? Aw, oh, man. Alright, alright, alright. I got a feeling that if I just gotta go up. Island of the Lost Angels. I ain't looking forward to this. Not one bit. No, 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 no. Oh, we gotta... Wait, why can't I go up? Okay, I was wondering what the hell is going on. For some reason, I could not go up. Oh, God. Thank you, Mike, for going by. Okay, so that goes there, that goes there, that goes there. Is there anything specific over this side? It just feels like there should be something over here. There's just not. Huh, weird. Anyway, let's get let's go up. The faster we can find Angie, the better. Okay, what the hell is with this place, I swear. Huh. Around here? No. About here. Easy! Alright, I'm gonna save. I don't feel comfortable. Someone's skilled at the piano. Sorry for the cutaway crew. You think Angie's playing? It's definitely her. The way they're playing is empty and cold. I see. Venom, are you afraid? The hell? I'm not scared. I'm just really cold. Mm-hmm. Then you won't mind if I walk in front. Hm, of course not. I don't know, what do you think, Mugen? Venom sca is Venom scared? Yes. Dang, that's two votes f for scared, then. I am not scared! W what the hell? These are the Rangers Crawley sent. And there's Alex and Sam among them. I hope you like them. Angie placed them for you three as a welcoming gift. Is this what Angie finds welcoming? Is she all right in the head? What? You don't like it? I feel like it holds a nice degree of charm. Uh, that just flew right by. Weird. The rangers of Terajuma Island completely encased in ice. The models that are supposed to represent hope and now now represent despair. I think I think it's wonderful. You know. I don't remember asking what you thought. Who are you anyway? Where's Angie? <laughs> Angie's waiting for you in the next room. Don't keep her waiting. I wanna knock her I wanna knock her teeth in. Who does she who does she think she is? Probably some corny maid wannabe. That has nothing else to do. Yeah, you, you don't you don't seem wrong. For the record, I'm never scared. I never get scared. Ever. Yeah, sure. Sure, Veronica. Sure. You must you must be Angie. She's talking to you. Hey. Huh? Children of the Almighty, I am here. How does it feel to be disregarded and disrespected? Does it doesn't doesn't feel so good now does it we are not of the highest priority are we not of the highest priority rather is that gym badge not important to you did you not hear angie when she said to come here and nowhere else okay apparently me and me admitted of using the one being we disrespected you what the hell did we do you dare go off on your own around crystalline town after we invited you specifically to this church you have a lot of nerve, Melia, Veronica, and Mugen. You know our names? By the way, it's Venom, not Veronica. Nonsense. You are blessed with one name only. Yes. To answer your previous question, I am Angie. I am the gym leader of Crystalline Town and the headmistress of the Order of Arceus. 
Self-proclaimed leader, I'm sure. The League administration would never allow someone like you in. And that's really saying something considering who's actually in. She's right. Incidentally, what gives you the right to terrorize innocent people? You're nothing but a dictator, a fraud, Angie. And we've come here to take you down. You insolent wretch! That's enough, Sarah. Y yes Lady Angie. You three, thro you three throw. You're this, you're that. But what about yourselves? What? Sarah, the book. Of course, Lady Angie. Let's see here. Ah, yes. Let's start with you, Veronica Vallesi. You know my full name? Are you stalking me? It says here that you are incredibly bold. You are incredibly bold, brave, and courageous. Conversely, you are a coward, brutal, fraudulent, treacherous, and conniving. If I, if the things you say about me are true, then you are no better than I. Correct? Where are you getting this from? You took the job of fixing the warp pads around the jungle for your own benefit. The only reason why you even gave up that money was because of Melia's morale. As for you, Melia, you are a strong, you are a leader, strong, caring, and intelligent. But you will also bring upon a facade that only those close to you can see past. The face of a scared and helpless girl, nothing but fear and cowardice lies beneath. After all, you brought Mugen all this way to gain brat badges so that they can accompany you on your uh, you on Valor Mountain, completely disregarding the possibility that they may not want to in the first place. Your entire motivation is selfish and self-centered. It's not true. As for you, Mugen, stop it! I don't care what that stupid book says. You claim to be a gym leader, but you hold no sense of responsibility. This isn't the way a gym leader is supposed to act. They're supposed to keep the community safe. They're supposed to... Oh, oh, oh. What? <laughs> What's so funny? Your ignorance is absolutely baffling. You think that just because I'm a gym leader, I'm supposed to adhere to some sort of status quo? You have the nerve to come to this church and proclaim my ignorance? Outrageous! You're incredibly naive, Melia. All of you are. Being a gym leader means nothing in the eyes of the Lord. It is simply a title. You are a regular human regardless. People may have ideals and beliefs, but there is only one that can shine brightest. God, or our mighty savior, Arceus. You're insane. Perhaps I am. However, this insanity is born from the sanity that is Arceus. Veronica, it's Venom! Melia Mugen. Show me your darkness, so that I may bring you light! A, a dimensional rift? Okay, that was dirty. It it's so cold. Ugh, my head. Mugen, is that you? So... Where the hell are we? Weren't we just in Angie's church with- Oh god. Where's Melia? She was just here. Come on. She could be anywhere. We need to start looking. Yeah, you, you, you get on that, fam. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Melia, thank God you're all right. Melia, are you all right? Are you not hurt or anything? Melia? Predictable. Unfortu unfortunately, predictable. What is it about people that allows them to be lured and deceived so easily? It's incredibly distasteful. That aside, welcome to the Tower of Theoria. Theola, my bad. I know your ideals may shine through if you make it the way, make it that way. As for your companions, they are safe for now. They are stashed away deep beneath the corridors of this tower. If your ideals truly shine through most, prove it. Face me within those rooms and rescue your friends. Until then, farewell, Mugen. Fine, I'll play your game, Angie. Don't expect to win, though. Oh god, just a bunch of ice puzzles. But this is what we're doing now. Ooh, thank you. Ooh, thank you! Isn't Frost Breath the one that always crits? When I have not looked at my actual stuff. Huh, for a bit, I thought I could actually teach that to Cusco. For a swift moment.
Let's see. Here, 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 and here. Easy! This is the truth reflection in your heart, Veronica. I refuse to believe that that this is fact. Show me the truth reflection. My, my, my name is Veronica Vasily. I'm here to play a song for you, Angie. Please die. Please die already. Unfortunately, that's the wrong answer. Seems we still have a lot of work to do here, Veronica. Keep playing. I assure you that one day you'll get it right. Uh. Okay, uh, I'm gonna need you to let my friend Venom go. Are you curious to see the truest reflection of your heart? Angie can do it for you too. Yeah, I'm gonna have to ask you to step off, Chief. Alright, I'm gonna swap over to... Okay, he's got the executor coming in. Catch his flamethrower! This one's Mighty Anna. Alright, I'm starting to get an idea for what this place is like. Get out of my face! Yara must be filled with nothing but evil. Perhaps it's best not to take a look. Che, I'm as pure as it comes. You don't judge the, the purest. Yes, I can get through this entire thing like in seconds. I'm glad they put a heal there. here. Not here, 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 through here. Go, no. Nope. That Pokemon on here? Deli Bird, that'd be you? Alright, uh, where are my repels at? 21 and ready to go. Here, 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 and through. You must interrupt the show. Angie isn't finished playing with Veronica yet. Sorry, I'm gonna have to cut the show short. Okay, apparently in this place my um my fire attacks are gonna have a problem. What about my rock slide? God damn it. Get clapped! I'm gonna use laxes for this. Hit him with a spark! Thank you for making it easier to kill you. Why would you interrupt such a beautiful concert? Cause I need my friend back, if you please. I don't get what Angie's up to, but I'm gonna say this right now. She twisted as hell. 
Excuse me, but the current show is not over yet. Audiences are required to stay on the lower floor. No, I I'm ready to end the show. So that's so. Time to present us the finale. I am a selfish girl who only thinks of herself. Who cares about Melly and Mugen? I I don't. I I should be sacrificed to Arceus because I don't deserve the gift of life that I was given. I want to be cleansed. I am happy and extremely proud to hear you say that. Your sacrifice shall be a great one. Arceus shall be pleased. Oh, I'm gonna need you to give her back. Get back here! Hmm? You are much quicker than I anticipated. But no matter. Things are going accordingly. Screw you for making me say those things before, Angie. Who the hell do you think you are? I did not say those words. Those words came from the bottom of your heart. Those words weren't true. I care about Mugen and Amelia. Say what you will. They do not matter in the long run. I shall not be interrupted during this trial. Mates, please occupy Mugen. Mugen's time for the short while. As you wish, Lady Angie. We shall show you the power of Arceus. Sorry, we shall show you the power Arceus has bestowed upon us. We shall not fail. We do, do not fail me, mates. They shall only take a moment. Yeah, I'm gonna have to ask you both to step back before I slide your asses. Yeah, it's best I aim for the um, Avalog. It's alive? I'm impressed. That's gonna hurt, like really hurt. Alright, I need to kill the last Brooklyn. Oh, but I hope Avalog gets pre us. Alright, I'm at these flimper on you. Okay, that's gonna hurt. Like, really, really hurt. Hit him with the rock slide! They both avoided it? Okay. Yo, Kuzco, I need your help! Angie will be furious with me. Angie, Arceus, I have failed thee. The Angie, it seems as though we failed. Hmm, that's quite unfortunate. For you. And for you. What's wrong with you, lady? There's nothing wrong with me. You are all the ones that have been tainted by evil. You're crazy. You just killed two of your loyal servants. Why the hell would you do that? They failed their mission, and therefore they're no longer useful. I explained to Mugen earlier about my ideals. They can only shine if you make it that way. I intend to make mine shine brightest. You may have been successful now, but don't hold on to that pathetic sentiment. In the end, I shall reign superior and sacrifice your tainted souls back to Arceus, where they belong. To hell with your dumb fucking ideals! No one gives a living shit about them! Where is Melia? I know you have her. You best learn to watch your mouth and learn your place, peasant. It's true that Melia is in my possession. She is safe for the time being. But will she be for long? Let's find out. What the hell is the deal with all of this? Mugen, we have to hurry. We have to save Melia. I couldn't save her last time, but this time I'm determined. Damn, Angie is some hardcore sh hardcore shit, man. Anyway... So I'm gonna end it off crew during the next episode. We're gonna finish off Angie's little palace here Save Melody and take her down. Thank you all for joining me. This has been your boy the RPG prodigy 
like comment and subscribe for more content and i will see you in the next episode peace tell me pretty lies look me in the face tell me that you love me even if it's fake